Yo, this is the Scar City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And thank you to our sponsors at Alpha Claims and Hire, Birmingham's best and leading accident management company, alphaclaimsandhire.com. Tundi, man, Tundi's back. He's repping it big. Manchester is killing it right now. So big up to all the Manchester subscribers and everybody that's flying the flag for Manchester. Uh, Tundi has now took this international. He has opened up a business in Alicante in Spain. Spain, where as many people know there's different laws surrounding the use of cannabis and he has capitalized on this and opened his own social club where you can get the finest grown cannabis from the looks of it in Alicante so I highly recommend it and I'm happy for him because at the end of the day Tundi has been on a big journey if you don't know about Migs Manchester Migs go and check out my story that I did on him rest in peace and he was one of the people that actually inspired Tundi to start taking music properly and since then he's had a hell of a lot of success his most recent tune being out is jealousy i highly recommend it it's a banger bad mind, I get on. yo bad mind i forget on should i say bad mind i forget big money on my mind money on my mind i need cake have you ever kept it so real that you look fake but i also must highlight is kenny all-stars voice of the streets this freestyle is actually hands down the deepest freestyle i've heard at least this year probably longer definitely longer but this this year alone hands down the best freestyle he talks about his, his upbringing his story and that's what rap and hip-hop has always been about he's come with the wavy tunes he's come with the tunes of the club and now he's telling you as an artist a bit more about his story and also like yes so it's a very deep i don't want to give too much away there is a lot of twists and turns in this freestyle so go and check it out for yourself Kenny All Stars, Voice of the Streets, and BBC uh, One Extra. So I wish you all the best for Tundi with this new business venture. But it seems that in the UK, some people are still trying to uh, trying to do this themselves. I came across this story yesterday. A cannabis club in East London. It was called the Den, and it happened on the 15th of August, following a community-led intelligence. So that means the neighbours told the police that they were selling drugs from there. A significant amount of cannabis, approximately worth twenty thousand pound, both loose and bagged up into single deals was seized in addition to cash drug dealing paraphernalia and evidence of drug sales police and the local authorities now seek to obtain a closure order for the property a total of 52 people at the location were detained and searches were carried out several were given warnings for cannabis and one man was arrested for possession of class a's yesterday activities are part of operation continuum a local on ongoing operation tackling organized drug dealing in associated crime and identified individuals belonging to selling, dr uh, selling drugs in the cafe. The operation began 18 months ago when the police say they've made 350 arrests and got £350,000 in cash seized from this. So they've been basically acting on all the information they must receive throughout the year and then going to raid stuff. So these CAFs, I know they're going to happen. People are going to try and do them. But what you have to understand is the law is not the same in this country. You cannot do this. And what of the drinks that they actually highlight on the police website was Jamie's orgasmic energy drink. East London's best kept secret, they call it. That'll be interesting to find out. I don't think anyone's going to find out what's in Jamie's drink anymore at the same time. So I know that a lot of people are trying to replicate that. So if you do want to participate in a cannabis calf, you need to go about it the legal way. Go to Spain, open your own business there, or go to Amsterdam because they're not going to legalize it here. They have legalized it for medical use for for children with severe conditions but it's very limited i'd like to hear other people's opinions on this so go and big up these guys go and follow them online support this positive stuff and please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and big up once again to our sponsors at alpha claims and higher birmingham and we've got a hell of a lot more coming and some longer shows with more content please don't forget to turn on the notifications thank you